Martial arts events in Lawrenceburg, at least for now. The city says it's a case-by-case -case situation. 3B Fightwear is hosting this weekend's event that benefits those critically injured in war. Fox 19's Brad Underwood has more from Dearborn County. After last year's fiasco, cage fighting was banned in Lawrenceburg. 3B went to the city. They laid out a plan. Now they've got a fight here in Lawrenceburg. <laughs> As these fighters continue to get ready for the big event this weekend, you have to look back at how far they've come in the last year. The last time there was a cage fighting event, the city said no more. Had some problems with the promoter and not uh, doing certain things as far as uh, security and uh, restroom facilities and uh, controlling the alcohol sales. But 3B and its members didn't tap out. Three sessions with the council and with all we showed our events and everything and our background check, it really went well. Everything the city asked for, 3B did. Proper permits, organization, and public safety. Add to that, $5 from every ticket sold goes to the West Lafayette Veterans Home for Critically Wounded. There hasn't been a fight yet that we've just stuck all the money in our pockets and went. We'd like to get back to the area. We'd like to get back to some, somebody. We'd like to help those who have helped us. On the fight card, a couple of titles are up for grabs. Two of the fighters with 3B are hoping that their training will be the difference. You have to train, you have to be prepared, and you have to take it serious. It's, it's, it's not just two guys getting in there and brawling. It's a lot of skill, a lot of uh, chess match. <laughs> For a list of all the activities happening here this Saturday and the full fight card, go to fox19.com. In Lawrenceburg, Dearborn County, Brad Underwood, Fox 19 News.